And now, a tour of Carl's room, or Planet Primus. I really cannot tell. Um, most people probably know me through, gosh, probably robotics. Um, I was really active on my high school team, 1747, and now I uh, mentor and a game announce. Um, what else do I do? I, I play ukulele, I play D&D, &D, um, I love to hike, you know. Uh, I have a lot of, I love taking care of plants. There's a lot of things I love. Um, I love to start my day eating eggs and other vegetables and drinking a big glass of milk. I wake up just like anyone else. That's where I wake up that's a little odd. <laughs> My name's Carl Lanskren, and I sleep in a cargo ship. I remember when I first thought of this idea, it was actually at one of the last off-season events. Uh, and it was a joke. Uh, I was tearing down the field with um, two friends of mine, and mentioned how it would be just amusing to uh, create a couch or a bed um, out of a entire cargo ship because there's enough room in them. Uh, the room took me, gosh, how long? Yeah, this would have been a year and two months, probably, to finish the whole thing. Um, and a lot of it came together right at the end. Filming this actually helped get a lot of it done. I wanted to theme the room around this idea of crash landing in a jungly planet because I really love technology and plant life and greenery, nature. Uh, those two things combined together really represent my personality, who, me, who I am. And so that's kind of what I wanted to focus on when I was doing this room. So within the room, I have over 60 different plants from just a series of places that have gotten them, either propagations or from saving them from like dead and dying sections at different stores. I also have a really large ship picture that I've always really loved. I bought, bought it at a garage sale. I just really wanted to create an environment that felt like nature that I could still continue to, you know, work and play games in and read Chief Delphi and all that kind of fun stuff. The cargo ship itself was something that's been built slowly over the process of um, the last year or so. I've been slowly building different shelves throughout the entire um, cargo ship that it can store books and plants and such. I have hatch panel cabinets that actually open up and allow you to put things inside of them. In the front of the cargo ship, I keep my laundry basket and other laundry there. And then I also, since I spend a lot of time in the cargo ship, whether it's watching TV or playing games or stuff, I actually have a second monitor that drops down from the ceiling. So at a certain time of when I want to go to bed, my room actually will shut off the lights and it will simulate a sunset that is going on and have nature sounds, which I really, really love. Um, it just it gives us really good, enjoyable feeling. Um, and of course, once it's dark, what's, what's a cargo ship without some sort of interior lighting? And so I actually have it set up to turn on LEDs and it just gives me a really nice place to kind of chill out and relax. I, I really like being able to watch TV or something in there or, you know, do my Zoom calls or something. It's, it's a lot of fun. <laughs> I, I guess some people would call me crazy. <laughs> just hope it's in a good way. <laughs>